Good morning, peoples. I am glad to see you. I am sure that you are well. Now let's start our lesson. Look, please, at the photos. Describe them. Thank you. Very good. Now, what did you use when you describe persons? All right. You used adjectives. And the theme of our lesson is adjectives, characteristics. The aims of our lesson are use speaking and listening skills to provide sensitive feedback to peers. Use common participles as adjectives and order adjectives correctly in front of nouns on a growing range of familiar general and curricular topics. Give an opinion at sentence and discourse level on an increasing range of general and curricular topics. The next. Now you should describe yourself. For example, I am talented. Thank you very much. Very good. Now let's learn the new words. Repeat after me. Easy going. Patient. Generous. Modest. Mean. Arrogant. Moody. Outgoing. Now repeat these words once more. Thank you. Open your vocabulary notes and write down these words. Now let's do the next task. Let's find pairs of opposite adjectives using one adjective from box A and one from box B. B. Now let's start. Generals. Find his opposite adjectives. G write your generals mean. The next. Patient. Write your patient inpatient. The next. Shy. Write your shy arrogant. The next negative. Write your negative positive. The next friendly. Write your friendly unfriendly. The next peaceful. Write your peaceful, aggressive. And the last, helpful. Write your helpful, unhelpful. Now open your workbook, page 60, and let's do exercise 2. The task is complete the sentences with suitable personality adjectives. A person is someone who always smiles at people and say hello. Now, what adjective? Right here. A person is someone who doesn't have many original ideas. Right here. A person is someone who wants to get a good job in the future. Very good. Person is someone who is good at making things with their hands. Number five. Person doesn't like giving things to other people. Good. Number six. Person is someone who gets angry when they are 
when they have to wait for a long time. That's right. Person is someone who often feels sad and angry. Good. Person is someone who thinks about the bad things in the world. Very good. And the last. Person is someone who is relaxed and doesn't often get angry. Good. Now let's do the next exercise. Open your student's book, page 82, exercise 2. The task is choose adjectives from box B from exercise 1 to describe the people. For example, Aristan is very relaxed. It is easy going. Now the first. Yerasil always gets the best marks in exams, but he never talks about it. Thank you very much. The next. Olga always does the washing up. Good. Sherhan always gives us expensive presents. Good. Tamiris wants to be the best at everything. Brilliant. Iskander is a quiet and calm boy. Good. Asiya always thinks everything is bad. Very good. Batir doesn't like big parties. Good. Inju is good at meeting new people. Very good. Norland hates waiting. Brilliant. Alina writes stories and songs. Very good. Umid doesn't like having fun. Very good. Now let's continue. Now open your workbook, page 60, exercise 3. The task is complete the text with the words. Now look please what words. The first, moody, shy, ambitious, generous, friendly, positive. Okay, now let's read the text. I think I'm a serious person. At school, I study hard and I always do my homework. I am also, I want to be a doctor in the future. My teachers sometimes think I am because I don't ask many questions and I don't like talking in front of the class. But I am very with the girls at school and we always laugh and chat in the morning. The next text. Everybody says I am a very person. I always give my friends nice presents and I buy flowers for my mom on her birthday. I don't like negative people. I always try to see the good things in the world because I want to be a person. But I am not happy all the time. My dad says I am because I sometimes feel bad when I get up. But after breakfast I am happy again. Now let's continue. It's a reflection. Now you should Continue the sentences. For example, today I found out new words. Now let's start. Today I found out. Very good. It was interesting. Good. It was difficult. Good. I understood that. Very good. I have learned. 
okay now I can good I could very good I'll try brilliant I was surprised and the last I want to know good now open your diaries and write down your home task your home task will be exercise 4 page 60 workbook now the lesson is over you may be free